Good day, beautiful people. I'm Justina, and welcome back to my channel, DIY Natural Skincare. So today, let's make a simple and short video, <laughs> and we're gonna make today a DIY under eye gel. So for this kind of poofy eyes, you know, when you wake up off the some mornings, you know, if you didn't have enough to sleep or you cried a lot, like I like to do this, or, or you know, you just being dehydrated, you know, and you're waking up with this poofy eyes, yeah? So we're gonna make a pretty simple recipe with a few ingredients, because I do believe in simplicity and that with a few ingredients, you can achieve a very good product. So, what we're gonna need, I have in here already pre-mixed, as usual, the whole formula and recipe you will find in the description box below. So not to waste more of your time, I have in here already pre-mixed xanthan and vegetable glycerin. I have 1% uh, xanthan gum and 10% vegetable glycerin. And I like to, when I'm putting this together, I like to kind of leave it aside for like minimum 20 minutes, 30 minutes to kind of let them bound together better. Yeah, so I have in here and it's ready to use now. For this, then we're gonna need a hydrosol. I'm using Neroli, uh, orange blossom hydrosol, and it smells fantastic. If you don't have Neroli hydrosol, it's fine. Feel free to use anything what you have, or like rose hydrosol, lavender hydrosol, or chamomile hydrosol will work perfect as well. So we're not gonna use any essential oils because as you know, the most sensitive skin on your body is under eye skin, okay? So we're not using any essential oils and there will be enough nice kind of smell and good properties from your chosen hydrosol. As well, I now want to do just add aloe vera gel into my hydrosol. I'm gonna put like 10% um, of the formula and which is 3 grams because I'm making 30 grams of it. Okay, perfect. So aloe vera gel has so many great properties. It does moisturize, it hydrates your skin, it's super soothing and softs the skin. So and now what we're gonna do, I just gonna add my um, hydrosol and aloe vera gel into xanthan gum and vegetable glycerin mixture. Just gonna add a little bit and just gonna mix it truly. Just trying to mix everything together and kind of just to get this gel consistency. Okay. Because it's all water-based products here, uh, when we're gonna mix everything here, I'm gonna check the pH, and then we just need to add the preservative, of course. Uh, for this, okay, can add a whole lot here. For this, I'm gonna use the Coast Guard preservative. The Coast Guard preservative is a natural organic preservative. And it's a water soluble preservative, so it would be perfect for this formulation. Okay, to help me out with this, I'm just gonna use my little former to try to get more gel consistent and mix it through. I'm just gonna use this little former to mix it, everything. It's a lovely smell here no essential oils super simple super easy to do give it a try guys as well and um, with the preservative it will last you as minimum as six months it probably will last you even more than this but um, yeah oh it's such a perfect clear as the sea gel consistency lovely i'm just gonna mix a little bit more and as well, what I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna put it in the little jar here, this little jar, and I'm just gonna keep it in the fridge 
for this cooling sensation you know I'm not gonna use it every day because you know there's just there's no point to use it every day I will just leave it in the fridge it will be nice and cool to use whenever I will need it and it can stay in the fridge with preservative for like as I said as minimum as six months you know so it's really good product to have it you know whatever it's needed few ingredients super simple and you can make your own and you don't need to buy these expensive eye gels <laughs> okay let's check then okay ph i need to adjust a little bit because it's like getting into a little greener to adjust pH level, I'm just gonna add a little, little pinch of citric acid. Little pinch of citric acid. And I'm just gonna mix it again. Everything. Very well. Oh, it's lovely smell. You know, you definitely don't need any essential oils. Choose your favorite hydrosol and it will give you this nice smell. Okay, let's check pH again. Yes, it got now brighter, more to the orangey color. That's what we need. And now I'm just gonna put this on the scale. I'm gonna add uh, 0.3 grams of preservative, Coast Guard preservative, which is water based preservative. Okay, mix it again and everything. And now we can double check pH as well. So we're checking pH before we're adding preservative, then we're adding preservative, and we uh, then checking again. And yeah, it's like this little like orangey color as you see, which is a perfect pH. It is between 4.5 and 5.5. And yeah, it's ready to use. Super simple to do, guys. And I'm just gonna transfer it in this little jar and leave it in my fridge. And we'll use it whenever I will need it. And just to apply under the eye and just to leave it. It will absorb into the skin, you know, and you can just leave it here and it's very good for your under eye skin. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed this video guys, subscribe to my channel, give it a try to this product, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below, and I'll see you next week, bye!